When it comes to the new DLC update coming soon to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot Season Pass holders and shortly after for everybody else, we know a lot of things. We know we are going to be able to train with Whis and we know we will have a new boss battle with Beerus. This sounds a lot like Battle of Gods but it's actually just loosely inspired by Battle of Gods. We aren't getting the whole new story arc. In fact, the developers are calling this an original story episode. As for the Super Saiyan God ritual which turned Goku into to a super saiyan god we have yet to see anything officially revealed when it comes to that but we've known about the ritual being in the game's files for months now and in the files it actually says that future trunks will be in the ritual instead of pregnant videl so there's obviously a lot of stuff that actually never happened in the anime and one of those things is vegeta turning into a super saiyan god in the manga we didn't see vegeta turn into a super saiyan god until the goku black arc and in the anime this didn't happen until the broly movie he always skipped to Super Saiyan Blue and even though we already knew he could always just turn into a Super Saiyan God if he wanted to. But there is one thing that I keep hearing and I honestly don't know why. A lot of people are saying this DLC will bring an explanation to how Vegeta learned how to become a Super Saiyan God. This idea stems from people saying, oh we never saw how Vegeta learned how to be a Super Saiyan God in the anime so they're probably going to show it in the game since he's already a Super Saiyan God during the Battle of Gods arc. But to all these people, if you're watching, I'm sorry, but you're just wrong. In the anime, we did see how Vegeta learned to become a god, and that was the exact same time that Goku learned how to achieve this as well. This happened in the Resurrection F arc of the anime, where Goku and Vegeta are sent to another dimension, and there they discover how to not let their energy leak out of their bodies, and figure out the secret to divine energy, aka God Key. After this, we see that they are able to turn into Super Saiyan Blue in the fight with Frieza. All they needed to learn was how to use God Key, and once they applied God Key to their base form, they became Super Saiyan Gods. Then when applied to their Super Saiyan form, they become Super Saiyan Blue, and this all came about by training with Whis, which is why in the game you'll be able to train with Whis and unlock the Super Saiyan God form for both Goku and Vegeta. Not as much story as the anime, but in the game that's all there's going to be when it comes to unlocking the form. There will Will not be a whole sub story to how Vegeta learned how to become a god because we already know how he became a god. I hope I cleared up some things for you guys who thought this might happen or were a little confused by this whole thing but I want to thank you guys for watching today's video. I would appreciate it if you left a like before you go. My name's Konjic and I'll talk to you in the next video.